you know we love tours, but what's even better than a tour of an RV is touring RVs of people who are living in the RVs. Well, let's check out the, uh, the zero dollar trade in. Yeah. I'm liking it. My, my nose is burning like I'm going to cry. <laughs> Son of a man who worked his fingers to the bone. Just trying to make something out of nothing. You know. How long have you had this rig? 11 years. 11 years. Yeah, yeah there you go. That is pretty cool. <laughs> never wanted silver, gold, or the finer things. Just a wife and kids are home in the American dream. So we're in Albuquerque, New Mexico. This is a rally called the Full-Time Family Rally. There's like 60-ish families that are living and traveling in their RVs here at this rally. My goal is to not eat anybody's food during the entire time we're touring rigs. One of the secondary goal is for Marissa not to get any more ideas of what we're gonna do to our RV over here. Neither of those will happen. You can't leave food out Dude. with Nathan tours. She like, <laughs> is this, yeah, is this like for people to I'm eat? I'm actually or? craving yes. Twizzlers because it, we had a comment in one of our video about what's your favorite road oh. trip pastime, yes. and somebody said Twizzlers, and now ever since I'm mm -hmm. like, I want a Twizzler. What are the chances? Like, yes. Yeah, so it had a dresser before, uh. and then we, we took out the dresser. We, we don't have a washer dryer, so we ended up putting in there for us to do like our clothes or whatever and then we built this because steve needs to work and, and you so added is this uh -huh. you yeah. i like that yeah, so yeah. we just did this we bought it brand new so we didn't want to add too much right away but you wanted to make now it your own you've got a very yeah. new mexico thing here yes, i like yes. it yes. Yeah. are you going to change it every state you go to <laughs> <laughs> no we went to santa fe today and picked this oh up. <laughs> authentic i yeah. like it yes, yes. so in here you took out the couch we took out the couch mm -hmm. and then there's a tv stand that fit the exact dimensions we needed. Uh-huh. And so, so that's a TV stand, huh? Yeah, and oh. I really like it. Um cuz it has built-in like doors oh, and then this is okay. shoes. Yeah. And then underneath if you lift it there's storage behind oh. it. That's good thinking. Yeah. IKEA? No, Amazon. <laughs> there you go. Wow. <laughs> it's one of the two. It's, it's one always yeah, one of the Is this yours? Uh-huh. Yeah? You like it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this down here um Oh, the shelves, yeah. Shelves. What was that before? It was, just, it was just a wall. You know, the way this counter sits in here, like all the drain stuff kind of came um, down. And yeah. You can see, I mean, I lost some space, but it was all the way in the back. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, there you go. That is pretty cool. <laughs> That's awesome. That actually is a great idea and a great use you an of engineer? space. Uh, no. No? You just... I, I'm an entrepreneur. I'm an entrepreneur. <laughs> so you hire an engineer. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. I actually came up with that on my own. And then the table is right at the right height. You see the uh, plastic containers down there? Okay, yeah. So those plastic containers, that's what the table sits okay. on. Okay. So this panel right here was all the way out to here. So oh, okay. I pushed that and cut a little wedge so that when the table, you know, when the whole bed drops down, it sits inside oh so right here you cut that out exactly. to make room for the thickness of this exactly so when it folds up this goes in and it just comes yeah, down into that little wedge the right there and the cords just down uh -huh. I love this. the pictures yeah that's, so that's cool uh -huh. yeah we do yeah, a lot of skiing and... oh taped it with the trash bag and thought that was good and it sat out for like five years so he went to trade it in to get something newer and the guy's like I can't give anything of this like it's it's trash like so the trade in value it was zero yeah so that perked my attention so it was free to me so we took it and did like entire like gut job like the whole back end off the floors out wow. like yeah so it's how long did that take uh it was about a year and a half but hey. i was working full time then i had a corporate okay. job at the time, so. well let's check out the uh the zero dollar trade in yeah, i'm liking yeah. it uh -huh. <laughs> oh, yeah uh, i don't even know where to start oh this is the same Betty's we have oh, look at this <laughs> <laughs> Adorable. So that's plumbed into your gray? Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah. Oh, 
yeah, this is the laundry room. Here's the panda. Oh, wow. And then you, they hang the laundry up here. Yep. We used one of these in the Airstream for three years. Yeah, so it just washes and it spin dries it mm -hmm. and then you hang hanging up. So it's definitely an option if you don't have a washer and dryer hookup. They take their coffee seriously, I love it. <laughs> oh, it's super cute. So. Yeah, you definitely have to be um, comfortable in your marriage. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. We have one of these in the Airstream. These are pretty cool. So you so it goes across. Yeah. And then, attach it. and then all your clothes will hang. Yeah. So you yeah. We had two of these in our bedroom in the Airstream. So we're going to upgrade. I mean, eventually we just did this to see if we could get out yeah. and do it. And no, like, that's, that's awesome. great. She's like, you know, if we get a new one too, though, you're going to start tearing apart. I'm like, no, it, it's brand new. Like, why? Why? But, like that. <laughs> hey, where was yeah. the where was the trash bag? Like, so there was a skylight up here. We're talking the uh, <laughs> the sink. It's oh, like okay, okay. You put a trash bag and duct tape. And so this skylight here. Yeah. Okay. So it drained like water pool. Oh so man. You can see where it's kind of mismatched where we had to yeah. take out yeah. stuff and then it drained all down. Water's a nightmare. What do we got? Is that white chocolate? What this is, is cinnamon roll. Okay. Oh. It should be cinnamon roll icing. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is strawberries and cream and this is pumpkin. It does taste like you're eating the icing off the cinnamon roll. Mm -hmm. Icing? Mm -hmm. Whoa, yeah. I like. love <laughs> personal touches. It is wonderful. Okay, this is this That's is what you pretty needed, cool. Yeah. That is super cool. They kept falling off, and you're like, just forget yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> it saved a lot of weight too. I yeah, honestly, like I think it's a cool. I like it. We've never seen a. Uh, the giant curtains like that from the top, that's really awesome. No, that's, that's good thinking though. So you painted, correct? I did, yeah. We painted and we did the peel and stick tile. Did you paint here and here? Was it just brown before? Yeah. And I like it. Yeah. I like the, the two-tone. We're, um, we're probably going to paint soon. Stop, stop. Every time we do these, she's like, we're painting. <laughs> <laughs> no, and I like this painted too, I definitely. it. I like that. Okay, well, I'm glad you at least, you're okay with that painting? I was afraid you were going to take it off. Well, we might take it off as well, I don't know. But I like it painted. <laughs> we left it brown last time, and I I like it painted. It just kind of recedes into the It does, it does. Is cool. I like the black, though. I like yeah. the black and white. It's you like pretty. the black and white? Yeah, it's really pretty. It's a, what is this color officially called? Is it a... Uh, Revere Pewter. Oh, wow. Benjamin. Revere Pewter. Or well, if you ask a guy, it's called white. <laughs> right. So yeah, the Dana is existing. We just like recovered. Did you take your balances off? We did. Yeah, I guess, yeah. Yeah. I started by taking the side balances off yeah. and then <laughs> I had put some like bamboo over the yeah. top balances. The one in the hallway is still like that. And then to get rid of weight, we just got rid of them all. So. It just makes the space so much bigger it really by taking does. the balances down and it looks modern and clean yeah. like you wouldn't yeah. think yeah. something's missing you think what is different yeah. in this rig something's different it feels bigger exactly yeah this it's is really one of the coolest mid bunks i've seen though look at this that makes me want to start playing <laughs> Now this is our model was supposed to sort of be like this, so this doesn't have the loft over the top, so you get the extra headroom. In case you're curious between like yeah. our model and this model, so we um, have you get the, the light, you get the headroom. It does feel way more spacious than ours. Yeah, ours is the three seven eight MBS, but ours does have the loft, and they typically don't. And this is what you would get. Was that desk what came with it, or did you take it out? Yeah, that was a dresser. Okay. And so we took out several of the drawers and used the existing drawer bites to make that pull out desk. Oh, oh that's okay. That's thinking. So this, this is the existing structure of what was here, exactly. and you just sort of yeah. took it out. That's a cool idea, that's though. That's great. Just to take what's already there and just... Did you even reuse the gliders that were I with did. the drawers? Yeah, wow. The and so you just got this board on your own and... and then we, I, I sought out that crossbar. Oh, that yeah. Yeah, so you just basically took that out. You left yeah. it, all that's in place. Yeah, I reinforced it a little bit with a bracket. Yeah. Just to make sure. Wow. Perfect. I'm digging this keyboard. It's pretty yeah. cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have been r trying to think of a way to put our kids' artwork on the wall. That's really cool. But our slides go in and out, and I, I didn't want to have to take it off the walls every time. But I love that you just put some tape to make borders for the artwork. That's yeah. that's. But what? How are these? Um, how are these fastened uh, to the wall? Command strips. Command so, yeah, strips. So just com command okay. uh, clips. Oh, so those. 
Okay, so it comes with a sticky already. The command clips. Wow, that's easy. Because Hens is... Hensley creates oh, goodness. We so many pieces of art, and I wanted a way to change them out to her new favorite. Do these stay on when your slides go in and out? Okay, I love that. Wow. Okay, you are this is, this is, uh... you are a girl after my own heart. <laughs> you don't even know you're in an RV anymore at this point. That is so cute. What is it? Is this hinge open, I guess? Or what was it? Oh, that's the fanciest control panel cover oh. I've ever seen. <laughs> now, is this just the IKEA? I've seen these. Yes. Yes. Oh, wow. I like this a lot. It's so cute. <laughs> It's so simple. Oh. You do the interior design stuff? Is that is so our background there at all? When I went into college, I'm like, do I go into nursing or interior? Design? Okay, okay. <laughs> I pick nursing. Oh, uh, yeah. What kind of nursing? I'm a nurse informaticist. Oh, I don't even know so. what that is. <laughs> Not a nurse. <laughs> <laughs> but I work with like the electronic medical record system. Oh, okay. And project oh. management. So uh, very mobile, I guess. Huh? Yeah, yeah, that's exactly. cool. Oh wow, yeah, that's super cute. I want this in my bathroom. Is this the sticky stuff? It is peel and stick tile. It's a different brand though. It's like thick, like real. It tile. is thick. It's oh, not wow. the thin that we it put in our it open range. Really well. Yeah, it feels heavy duty, like yeah. really heavy duty. Like we had to use like a vinyl tile cutter to actually. Oh, okay. Wow. Well, these are nice. I've never seen that. Yes. I've seen that. That's so pretty. I actually this is uh, this is flexible. If you need more towel hanging space, that might be better than hanging it yes, over our toilet. Yes, I hate that ours hang <laughs> right on our toilet. Is that a laundry basket? That's the cutest laundry what? basket I've ever seen. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> it's cute. No, I definitely love all the patterns and all the colors. This is cute. Well, just it takes a special touch. I'm not brave enough to go with this. Marissa brings me a pattern, and I'm like, no, 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 because I just I can't envision it at all. See, I know it looks good. I just have a hard time putting it together. That is so cute. Uh, who wanted the dog over here? That was our English bulldog. Oh. Um, we had him for like eight years before we had our daughter, so it's a commemorative. <laughs> that is. That is so. That, that is the coolest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> my, my nose is burning like I'm gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> I wanna see the world from the edge of my seat. A big windshield or a plane, not a TV screen. Don't you need the road to tell you who you really are? Find out whether or not a man could ever change his stars. Quite the hat collection. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah, some people collect stickers everywhere they go, yeah. and you collect hats. I love yeah. it. <laughs> uh, did you build this desk out? We built this out. You okay. see, like a little small dinette, uh -huh. mm -hmm. and little chairs facing each other, and so we took that out and put this in. And our son has a little workstation. Is that a keyboard? There's a keyboard under there, so we can play that <laughs> keyboard. <laughs> we need to get that way. So into this. She yeah. is totally into this. Oh, she has this like a little, little. This was like a little simple that robot. Is I, mean, awesome. I just bought little slides. You know, yeah. Uh, Home Depot. Yeah. 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 So not too much TV going on here, I guess. Huh? No, no. We got two, there's so many TVs here. We got too many TVs. Yeah. What's it? One, two, three, four. Yeah. We got four. one outside. That's what. Yeah. We got here. And how long are you? How, how long are 38. you? Thirty-eight. Uh, Thirty-eight. So yeah. 30. four TVs and thirty-eight feet. Our yeah, first right. RV, we we're like, we have more TVs than we did in our house. Yeah. 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 <laughs> At home, we had one TV. You want yeah. to watch TV? You got to come in here to watch it. Do y'all move kind of fast? We or? do. We yeah. we've been. A year and a half, and like you can see the kind of ground that we've covered. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got Tennessee at least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got Tennessee. This is our living room, and um, this is where our sun sleep. That drops down, obviously. Uh -huh. And uh, we can create separation here. Oh. Is by just closing this, you know, so he has his own little. Okay, room I don't know right. if I've ever seen that yeah. before. I have it. Yeah, I have it. I wonder so, if they still make. The, do they, you know if they still make this model or? They don't make this model anymore. Okay. So, oh, so yeah, I've never seen. We're gonna help you sell this thing. Uh, if uh, yeah. I, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I contact. And the cool thing about this too is because when we're driving, uh -huh. um, we can use the auto AC and it cools this whole area because this is where we all hang yeah, out. When we're driving. Yeah, yeah. And, and everything because you walk back here, you know, it gets hot and stuff like yeah. that. Like I know we had our class A like 
the gassers are not known for their AC working well from the dash because yeah. the engine's right there. Yeah. So it is sometimes you go down the road with the AC on, yeah. and this is cool to be able to isolate it in here yeah. like this. Yeah, yeah, we get to shut it down. I like yeah. this. Makes it feel amazing. It makes yeah. it feel so much more like a home. I've yeah. never Having seen a layout doors. like this. Yeah. This is it's super cool. Yeah. It's it's really roomy. Are these like yeah, opposing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So these pump, these pump out. Yeah. They do come in, but I mean we still have the lane to go through. Like I said, it goes all the way through. The class A versus fifth wheel and trailer. The whole debate. Like you know, of course this is a class A, but we talk about a lot like when you when do you go motorhome or when do you not. I think this is a great example of you know they're traveling fast. They've hit 40 plus states in a year and a half. They've got one kid. I mean the layout just works and it works for their pace. I like the storage. <laughs> this is a 4K screen. That's uh -huh. the first thing. That's really nice. Of course, sit down, but also a uh, stand for a stand-up desk. Huh? This, oh. Ta-da! I like it. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. She's uh, offering fresh bread. She's offering. I yeah. wish this video was scratch and sniff because this smells <laughs> amazing. <laughs> and when somebody offers fresh bread. <laughs> so what's uh, what's the writing on the blocks? <laughs> Just quotes that I want to think about. That's cool. We don't have a medical record anywhere, maybe, but we do have. That's how we keep track of the kids' uh, growth. <laughs> We're just making ourselves at home here. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> that's really good. Mm -hmm. You have it all here, or you have it in here. Oh wow! And that's it. Look at our cabinet, bro. <laughs> I know. No, like. Very well organized. You like to cook, huh? Yeah. We like to eat. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Just we'll, come we'll over. We'll caravan. We'll caravan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just made like, crackers. Just you made, made crackers? crackers? Yeah. Yes, oh, I was, that was the one I was going mm -hmm. for. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there it is. You good? Mm -hmm. Well, crackers. for people who don't want to give up their cooking and their, you know, that's a right. fear for people. They, they love to cook. They don't want to give that up. You are myth busting that at this moment. <laughs> How long have you had this rig? 11 years. 11 years. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> but that's tons of time to like just keep modding it. Because everywhere I look, like I can see mods up here and mods here and just mods. Was your I baby mean, born in this rig? Two of them. Two of them. That's Two babies? Now I, yeah. Like right here? Right here. Right here. At the balloon fiesta four years ago. Right. <laughs> right. I just, I know how sentimental I get with rigs. I can't imagine if I like birthed my children in here. Yeah, so this was so, an office before? Well, this, yeah, this this was a whole big desk. Okay. And then, uh, and then yeah, we needed more space for it because uh, the little one, it used to sleep at the end of our bed. Uh-huh. So that changed, so we had to make one, one extra bed. So the oldest has this has this now. Yeah. Are all those custom, or did you buy like a kit or something? Or no, what's that this like is Ikea. Oh, wow. This is, we, we, we found an office that was, um, uh, selling all their furniture. Okay. And then uh, we went for a little bit, and they're like, "Oh, we can do the whole thing." And then, uh, so we then we bought a bunch more of these. It may be a little too heavy, but for the weight, but it's at the on the other hand, it's all sturdy and right here it keeps it doesn't yeah. fall out. Yeah, I like it. You got this. I guess the kids can do schoolwork. Yeah, yeah, they the school. craft. Uh -huh. They craft in here. <laughs> oh, we're Why just in time. Oh, just in time for dinner, huh? Well, we didn't know you were making dinner. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what do you know? So sorry. Hi. <laughs> hey guys! Wow. You have you. These are like the coolest cats. What what? These are savannas. Savannas. And they're a cross between an African serval and a uh, house cat. Hensley's already what? been inquiring because she wants she, to walk a cat so she bad. She is so welcome. Oh yeah yeah. She a cross would, between a, between a what? Did you say? An, an African, African serval. Okay. And a house cat. And the serval's pretty good. It's yeah. bigger, right? Yeah. So, yeah. so at some point, those two. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. Apparently, it can happen. So. Because these I are know. large cats. Yeah. So. Oh, hi. Well, Hunter. So this is Hunter. Oh wow! Yeah, they're furred. And but the best part is right, right here. He's just so soft. Oh wow! You. It feels like a lion's mane or something. Yeah. You've touched cool. a lion's mane. Um, who hasn't? <laughs> <laughs> So two years ish, Newmar did, and you yeah. see that's what this is on the floor here. They did some mid-engine models. I don't know if that was a new guy or what. It's pretty cool they yeah. let him go. They, I, they, I know. They somebody I, said, look, like, just go with it, man. You, yeah. We toured a mid-engine that was almost like a boat in the back. Oh my goodness. Check this out. So cool. So you got a step up area. Oh my goodness. Up into this bunk area up top. This is genius. It's got a TV right here on the back of the steps. 
go look at the Newmar, uh, Newmar site and there's an owner site and you can download the brochures of that year and you can see they had a toy hauler which yeah, they, yeah, had a yeah. they had a party version. The whole back end was a party like um, a bar area yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> with a second fridge and everything. Yeah, They just so, let that guy go, man. Yeah. <laughs> That's so awesome. It's like, with no motor in the back, uh -huh, uh -huh. what can you do? The engine, the, the water tanks, and the fuel are between the axles. Two axles, it's 32,500 pounds, but I can carry with full water and fuel almost 6,000 pounds of cargo. So almost no litter comes out of. Okay. Because the cats come in through oh, a grass thing there, they come up okay. another grass thing, and then go in the litter box. You know what a diaper genie is? Uh, yeah, yeah. So we have a litter genie, let's okay. call it litter mate. So it does the same thing. You put all the stinky stuff in there. Uh -huh. and that's why it doesn't smell in here. Mm -hmm. This is a spill proof and splash mostly proof dog bowl, but this is a small size and it works for the cats. But there's a little line in there, and there's water in there. You can see it. <laughs> This is standard, right? The bunks. Yep. This is how this is how it's designed. How the so bunks. The, the top is Gabe's sleep area. The bottom uh -huh. of it is his adventure area. His yes. space, right? Uh -huh. Sort of like what you did with your daughter yep. in one of your videos. Yeah. The top is Hensley's bed. So the bottom, we wanted her to have her own space. Um, so we made this into a play area. You can play. Yes. Yeah. And these are the only pass-throughs. Okay. So this is my my sewer bay. Yeah. So typically with a diesel. You would have passed through all the way through here because yes. it's mid-engine. But that's my radiator. Yeah. This is a little bay where I check my oil uh -huh. and stuff like that. Okay. This is the back end of the big storage bay. And so you can get to some stuff in there, like okay. storage yeah. underneath. This is a little storage area in here, very thin, like pegboard. This is the box of the queen bed. Uh-huh. And so this this ledge here is the walk around. And if there was no nothing here, you and I could walk all the way in here, and this would be three inches above our head. We put the slide tray in, and now I take the e-bikes, drop the front wheels, put them on this, mm -hmm. and fold the handlebars down, take the sea south, and I can put all three in there. Yeah. With my little giant, with my little ladder, all my tools. Awesome. It all fits. Just get out there and get started. You know, we've seen people with. Um, rigs that were worth zero dollars or there's expensive rigs that were ready to go and they didn't have to do any renovations they were just looking to get on the road so I think no matter where you are in your journey it's just it's just exciting to see these families living their dream I hope you've gathered some ideas to help you on your journey uh, that's our journey for today Till next time catch you guys later